from the very beginning. There are four key points. The first point is, we said we're going to attempt to predict the winning 4D numbers for today's draw and today only. Mm -hmm. We also said that we're going to seal our prediction within a red packet. This is the form of a typewritten note, but we've also included a single lottery ticket with a single number. Everything went inside the red packet, it got sealed up in the boxes. I was hanging outside St. James for five days. Okay, and we've also said that we do not encourage gambling, we don't encourage it, we don't condone it. And of course, our next important point is we do not have any supernatural powers or spiritual guidance of any kind. That's right. So, can we indeed predict the winning 4D numbers? People have been asking us for the whole week, are you confident? Can you do this? Well, I can tell you this. We were so confident that we would predict the winning 4D numbers, we actually placed a third item inside. Ronita, what I'd like you to do is to just lift up the flap of the red packet. You'll see a paper clip. Attached to the paper clip is a piece of paper. Remove the piece of paper with the paper clip out and leave the rest of the contents inside the red packet. So just a single paper attached to the paper clip. Remove everything and just pull it out. Pull the paper clip out together. That's very good. Now what I'd like you to do is to, into the microphone, nice and loud, I'm just going to bring this down a bit for you. I'd like you to just tell the audience what you are holding. What I have in my hand is a check to the Children's Cancer Foundation for $10,000. Can you please read the date of the check? The check is dated 21st of January 2010. That was the day we made our prediction. That's right. Can I have the check, please? Ladies and gentlemen, now this is a legit check from JC and myself of $10,000 to the Children's Cancer Foundation. And you know what? We are very pleased to announce that we have the chairman of the Children's Cancer Foundation, <coughs> Mr. Ravi Sivalinga, here to, pre to personally receive the check today. Everyone, please give him a big round of applause. Hi, Ravi. Step right up here. You know, on behalf of Ming and myself, we'd like to make this donation to the Children's Cancer Foundation. <laughs> Thank you. Now, I know some kids who really need it, so I really hope this helps. Thank you. Thank you very much. We go back down to your seat. Thank you. I think I should also stress uh, that uh, this has not been prearranged with Children's Cancer Foundation in any way prior to this impossible 4D prediction. In fact, I believe your office only told you yesterday to come down to receive the check, correct? Thank you very much. So, did we or did we not predict the winning 4D numbers? Ranita is back on you. Now, there's one remaining item inside the red packet. I'd like you to remove that typewritten note, but do not unfold it just yet. So take it out of the red packet. I'm hoping that it's a check written in my name. <laughs> <laughs> Give me the red packet, please. I'll just show everyone that there's nothing else inside. Empty, empty, empty. Okay, Renita, I'll let you to open the letter. Just unfold it once. Just once? Unfold it just once? And can you please read out to everyone what is typed on it? The letter says, 4D prediction by JC Sum and Magic Bait Ning. We predict that the 4D top prize number for the draw on 27th January 2010, Wednesday, will be... Hold on. Could we just flash the 4D results once again on the screen? We'd like you to take note of the top number right over there. Ranita, could you please unfold it completely and read out the number we predicted? The magic, magic number that they predicted is 5853. Please turn it around, show to everyone that prediction right there. Ladies and gentlemen, it's a perfect match. Five, eight, five, three. Could I take the prediction, please? Now, as you can see, there's a single lottery ticket attached to our 100% correct prediction. 
that we made one week ago and signed. So I'm sure all of you are wondering, is this ticket real? I can assure you that this ticket is 100% real. You see, one thing we like to point out, Ning and myself, we are professional illusionists. Our goal is to provoke wonder and thought. And I think we did that this past week, right? Mm -hmm. And uh, you know, from the start, we've also said that we do not encourage, we do not condone gambling. That's exactly right. Well, the thing is, we also have always stressed, we will never use our unique skill set to get any advantage over Singaporeans. Mm -hmm. And if we were to contribute to a charitable cause, it will have to be done from our own hard-earned money, just like any other Singaporean in any other profession. For well, those two reasons, while we did 100% predict the winning numbers for today's draw, we did buy a ticket, but we intentionally bought a number that would not win. So we bought the number zero, 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 zero. Now you have to remember, from the start, we said we would buy a single lottery ticket with a single number. But we never ever said that it would be on the number that we predicted. Well, ladies and gentlemen, we'd like to thank Ranita for her time and effort in auditing the impossible quality prediction. Thank, thank you, you very Ranita. much. Everyone, please give her a big round of applause. Well, there you have it. We have wrapped up an exciting week with this psychological illusion. We're really happy that you are part of history. You know, we are thrilled that we did indeed predict the correct winning numbers of this week's 4D draw. Uh -huh. But I think we're more thrilled that we can really contribute to Singaporeans who need the money more than we do. Yeah, please, um, if you can, if it's within your means, please go ahead and uh, help charities. In fact, if you'd like to make contributions to the Children's Cancer Foundation, you can do so online through their website, which is www.ccf.org.sg. But you know what, thank you so much for being here. Thank you for your time. My name is JC Sung. And I'm Magic Bay Ning. Thank you very much.